Welcome everybody, this is Link. And Sora. We are here with another update video. This is number 42. 42, right? Is that, that yep. was a question? Okay, <laughs> that was a question. Uh, we're, we're here to give you some more gaming awesomeness, pounded out by two experts. <laughs> LOL, not really, but... Uh, Sonic Adventure, I'm getting close. He's getting close to it, and we'll talk about that later in the What's Up with TRS, but first off, let's start off and say that we have 179 subscribers on YouTube, which is up four. Thank you so much, guys. You guys rule. Uh, we're at 3,772 views, which is up 38. We're still going strong on that. Thank you so much. Twitter at we're... Twitter... Twitter... Uh, bleh. Twitter, we're at 1,229 followers, which is up 16. That's awesome. Facebook, we're still at 111, but check it out, because there's some really cool new artwork that got put up that we're going to be using on our streams. Yep. Uh, Twitch, we're at 32 followers, which is the same, and 550 views, which is up 3. Thank you for joining us this past week on our stream. Yeah. You have a... <laughs> uh, talking about Smite Eden Eternal. Eden Eternal, the uh, server merge is coming closer and closer. It starts in April, which then there will no longer be the two separate servers. It means everyone will be together. And I'm not looking forward to the lag, but I'm looking forward to playing with my friends in the other server. And making it harder for you to hunt me down. You gonna talk That's anything? Right. You gonna talk uh, about spiders? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're still doing that. We sometimes get into games where we don't exactly like the people on our team because they're complaining that we're not helping them when they're charging straight forward into the enemy. It's like, how do you expect us to save your ass when you're solo charging into five people? <laughs> yeah, and you're the weakest character. Sounds like a Leroy Jenkins move. Yeah. They're playing as the squishiest character and charging straight into five enemies. <laughs> the squishiest character. I like how you described that. They're literally charging in as like an assassin. They're charging in as like Loki against five gods. <laughs> oh, that's probably not a good idea. No. And it's like, where's the guardian? Where's the tank? He's supposed to be with me. I'm like, short stubby legs? Can't run that fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like you in real life. I have long legs uh, in real life. I still can't run that fast, but... <laughs> it was just making a fat joke out of you. Oh. Sorry. Okay, what was last week's question? Last week's question was, how do you feel about indie games? Indie games. So how do you feel? They're... I feel like good indie games are good because they're not stuck to the AAA standards of game making. They can break the boundaries of it. They can do literally anything they want, whether it be yeah. Octodad or Rock Simulator or... Yeah. <laughs> They're not restricted to the boundaries of AAA titles. I mean, look at Minecraft. That's the most popular indie game out there, and it it took off like crazy. Yeah. It, it was like, hey, you know what? We're going to make a game. Or actually, it was, I'm going to make a game, and then it turned into, we're making a game, and then it turned into, we have the most popular indie game that's ever existed ever, and everyone's still buying it. There's new versions coming out, uh, like, I want to say almost every other week for the PC version, and then there's, like, the Xbox One version is on sale right now for $5. Which I fucking got for cheap! <laughs> $5 on Xbox One. Go check that out if you haven't already. Uh, and if you don't already have it, obviously. Beautiful 60 FPS. <laughs> That's crazy. And... The, the game is just wonderfully made, and in my opinion, indie games get the most creative. Because you they have are. people who don't have a lot of money, they don't have a giant budget, they don't have a set rules that they have to uh, meet up to. They just say, hey, we're going to make a game about this, and we're going to make it like this. And we're gonna they make have one it really thing cool. some AAA developers don't have, and that's a passion for what they do still. Well, yeah, a lot of the bigger developers, they just sit there and they say, we need a game. We need to sell a game, make money, and let's go do it. So that's what they do. But as an indie game, which is what we're working on right now, and we should be talking with Boogan about some game design plans. Um, if things go well, we should have probably a game by summer, and it'll be a little game, obviously, just to start off, yeah. but... 
eventually we're gonna work our way into a bigger game. Eventually. Eventually. <laughs> um, comment of the week goes to Euphoric Outlaw, which is one of those new subscribers, and he says that uh, gotta love some injustice, and if you haven't checked it out, our first Versus is completely uploaded as of this upcoming Thursday, so it's not completely uploaded yet. My bad, guys. Um, <laughs> as of this Thursday, all of the episodes should be done. Yep. I might have messed up on something. I think I <laughs> shared the up. wrong video and people can't even watch it. <laughs> That's well, <great. laughs> well, now, uh, yeah. So, link screwed up, but well, isn't he? <laughs> true. Our videos will be going up, and they'll be done. Yeah, it's I shared the wrong video. I think. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> Fucking amazing. <laughs> okay, so up to episode seven is uploaded right now. It goes through episode eleven. The ending is pretty much already determined at episode seven, though. <laughs> yeah. Arranged. <laughs> See, but we had some matches where we were both the same character, more or less. That's true. I'll give you that. You you so, got it. You got so it. So I I deserve that. It wasn't the just... ones where we were both the same were closer though. Well, of course they were closer, but you know I still won. <laughs> eh, it's fine. Justice just... is my type of thing. I... We're not going into this right now. I know. Um, <laughs> now who was Smash Bros? Come at me, bro. I have like a minute that's complete uh, you raging about the game and really mad and how you hate fighters, how you love fighters and stuff that I saved. So I'm going to pull that out on you one day. <laughs> okay. Oh, speaking of Smash Bros, I went to a party last night. And nice. at this party... There was some sake and some alcoholic beverages floating uh -huh. around. Sake is really good, by the way. I just had a little bit. Um, and we played Smash Bros. Yeah. Uh, the one for the Wii U. Which one's that? Is that just... Smash Bros. for Wii Okay, yeah. it's called Wii U. Okay, so we played yeah. Smash Bros. Wii U, and we got like this adapter thing, so I was playing on my... Uh, Oh, the GameCube. GameCube adapter. Yeah, I was playing on my GameCube controller, and we had five people playing, and I almost won a Sonic. Nice. I, Sonic I took... is really good in the new game. Oh, yeah. I was so close to winning. We were both at, like, 140%, one stock left, and then Sonic I... Sonic is actually the character I practiced with for competitive now, so... I practiced... Has been since Brawl. <laughs> I played with Link for a while, and I got consistently third place, so I decided I should change characters. I played as Pikachu and got third place, and then I played as Sonic and got second, and I was, like, almost first place, so... Uh, good no character that. you should have tried? Shulk. He's amazing. See, but the guy who played Shulk on that last map, he had the uh -huh. most kills, but he died, like, first, also. Like, he... Was, was he... Uh, depends on how he was using the Monado arts. It's a whole lot of complicated jarble. I don't even know what Smash Bros. is. Okay. <laughs> You're talking to the wrong person. Alright. Anyway, the live stream announcement this Friday. Be there. Last Thursday is when we had ours, so sorry for the people yep. looking for it on Friday. I had some scheduling issues with my work, but I don't yeah, have work lots this of Friday. Work. Uh, I went to work, went to school, went back to work, stayed at work for like six hours after I'd already been to work in the morning, and then school, it, was, it sucked. I was like, there was no way I was going to be able to stream even if I wanted to. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, I was planning on getting Rayman in <laughs> Minecraft. <laughs> and you were editing videos, right? Yeah, I actually am starting to. Yeah, we're going to have Smite videos up pretty soon, hopefully, as long as Star keeps going. <laughs> might happen, might not happen. <laughs> but I love, I love streaming Smite, but God... Damn, it sucks. <laughs> well, I've been trying to edit our Halo 4 stuff. I uh -huh. think for our first stream, it was like... It was a two-hour stream, and I got ten minutes out of it. And, like, I'm yeah. going through the, the second mission trying to do that, and it's like... It's it's not good. I can't figure out where the mission started, and then I can't figure... Like, I, I don't like Halo that much. It's, <laughs> like, it's fine to play it, but 
the first episode is pretty much going to be called Link Learns Halo because I'm asking you all the dumbest fucking questions. <laughs> like, like, watching myself talk, I'm like, oh my god, you are an idiot. You are <laughs> such an idiot. I'm just sitting there with, like, a pistol, just like, y just go do this. <laughs> You're like, don't follow me, don't follow me, and stay here. I'm like, okay, and then you blame it on me anyway when you fuck up. <laughs> And I'm like, I didn't do it, I just sat here like a good boy. <laughs> uh, yeah. Check out our Facebook, we have some new images uploaded and I keep posting new stuff, especially with the Majora's Mask stuff that's going around right now. Oh There's my all god, kinds of I want to get the 3D, the 3D remake. Um... Check out our Twitter, I always post on there, and I post videos that we post on YouTube, so if you don't want to check out our YouTube, check out our Twitter, I post those up there normally. And Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, we're still working on those. Um, they haven't had time to film. Oh, sorry guys, one more thing about the live stream. If there's a game you want us to play for this Friday, let us know in the comments below. We have an undecided game at the moment, we are thinking and, uh, about... I... I was going to say I have a wide library of PS2 games. And we have a way to record PS2 now. I also have a wide variety of PS2. I didn't even think about PS2. You have a PS2, right? Do you have the big fat I do. one? It's downstairs, yeah. <laughs> oh, you got the fatty. <laughs> I, I, have, I have two of the Slims. Okay. That's right, two. Like, everyone but, um, in my generation has two of those. It's real sad. <laughs> I think, last time I took account, the PS2 games I that is in this house is like 120? Wow, and I probably got like 30 or so also. Um, yeah. So, <laughs> well, <laughs> we're, we're pretty much set on this. If you have a PS2, a GameCube, a Wii, or uh, Xbox 360, even Xbox One, um, I think that's about all we got though right now that we're willing to plug in. Yeah, I don't want to go through the hassle of plugging in the Dreamcast. <laughs> No, I don't want to deal with that, or deal with a Nintendo 64 even right now. we yep. got to do some test stuff with that. Yep. But but soon. I promise you guys, soon. <laughs> so what's up with TRS down by you? Uh, down by Legends. Because Game of the Month. Amazing. Wow. Um, you just cut out. Can you repeat that? Uh, Rayman Legends is for free this month, month on Xbox One for Xbox Gold members. That's awesome. Which, it's normally a $40 game, and they're like, eh, here, take it. I know it's popular, but take it. <laughs> That's so cool. Got Minecraft for four ninety nine. Insane. And then I've been practicing my Sonic Adventure. I can now beat the Egg Hornet in 20 seconds? In case you guys don't know, this guy is trying to speedrun Sonic Adventure. Uh, he has the majority of the glitches down for Emerald Coast. I think that's the yeah. level. And yeah. he's working on some of the Tails stuff. He has that pretty much down pat. Uh, Fly, manually descend. I think Big All is you gonna, need. Big might be the biggest problem. Yeah, well, it's find Froggy, catch Froggy. And you know where Froggy is every time, so I guess. Yeah. And you don't really need the lure stuff. No. Got it. Froggy's always 500 grams. <laughs> okay. That is one fat-ass frog. That really is. That's like, that's not fat, actually, it's like half a kilogram, which is like, no, that's not big, that's not big at all, that's really small. Oh, okay, yeah, I guess I was... <laughs> Sorry, it feels like a lot because yeah. we're American and we do pounds and ounces. <laughs> yeah. Boo America. <laughs> Uh, Gamma will problem. Knuckles really isn't the problem either. I have all of his emblems. Okay, cool. So, we're gonna start doing that, or he's gonna start doing that. I'll yeah, probably I'm gonna just start sit there and thing. comment on stuff. Because I've noticed that if I'm talking and trying to do that, I don't do as well, but if I can just focus on the practice... It makes sense. Most speedrunners don't talk when they speedrun. Yeah. I have the friend do talking. <laughs> Okay, so, what's up with me is the wonderful Molly got me the awesome Ramune, orange, actually orange Oh, Black Betty! The, uh, American Ramune, it's like, 
adapted for America. It's clear. Yeah. It's not actually orange liquid. Ugh. And it makes me mad. But she got the orange stuff, which before a week or so ago, I didn't think you could get it anywhere but the Japanese marketplace market. down. Oh, you can't get the orange at World Market. You can't get the orange there. Okay. No, you can get the melon, you can get the grape, you can get okay. a couple other flavors, but you can't get orange. So I was like, okay. oh, I gotta go to Mitsuo to get orange ramen. That sucks. Or go to Amki. <laughs> I bought a whole giant pack of the orange stuff at Amki. I wondered what you spent a lot of your money on. <laughs> oh, yeah. I spent most of my money on ramen. And she also went, uh, when she got it, she went to Lost World of Wonders, which is a comic book shop in Milwaukee. Oh, yeah. And she got me this wonderful Batman figure from Arkham City. And I know Sora can't see this, so I'll show him afterwards. But it's the rabbit hole Batman with this cool fucking mask. And, like, I've been talking about this mask for days. Because it's uh, the Mad Hatter taking over Batman. And he puts on this, like, weird fucking rabbit mask thing. And it's, it's so cool. It's so creepy. That it's sounds am- weird. It's amazing. So I'll show you after this is done, but sounds good. It's it's really cool, and that's pretty much what's up with me. I've I've decided that I'm gonna start trying to speedrun a game in the Odd World series because I pretty much love those games to death, uh, and I figure if I play it 800 yeah, I, times I went, through, I'll be fine. I went back and watched the Sonic Adventure stream, and you were just like blown away at the speed, and I'm like, yeah, this isn't even fast. I know, but I I don't get Sonic games. I really oh. don't. And something I found out is that Sonic kind of started speedrunning in one of the games where if you beat a level in under 30 seconds, you get, like, extra points or whatever. Yeah. That's kind of what started the whole speedrunning craze. Yep. And I think that's really cool. That Sonic is the father of speedrunning. Which totally makes sense when you think about it, because <laughs> look at Sonic. So, yeah. <laughs> what's the question of the week? Question of the week is, how do you feel about kart racers? Kart racers. Like Mario Kart, Sonic and Sega All-Stars racing, uh, Rugrats racing. Would, uh, uh... Pretty much like racing games, I guess I'll go for. Racing games? I don't... But not like realistic, like cartoony. You're talking about, like, the the more animated ones. Yeah. Not like, not Need for Speed or anything, no. but like Crash Bandicoot Tag Team Racing yeah. kind of thing. Okay. Yeah, that type of racing. Okay, or like Diddy feel- Kong Racing. Diddy Kong Racing. So how do you feel about these animated character racing games, where they're more based on the characters, not the cars Physics. themselves? <laughs> well, you look at racing games, they're based on how you build your car, how you race your yeah. car. These games are more based on how you use power-ups and how... Yeah, uh, yeah actually, power-ups is probably the biggest thing that distinguishes them. Yep. Okay, so leave your comments below, and we'll talk about them next week. 200 sub art giveaway, well, we're getting closer, and I'm getting closer, and that's about all to say about that. So, do you have anything else you want to add? Uh, Black Betty. (laughs) He's playing Rayman Legends, and that's one of the songs uh, for the final level song scenes. Uh, Okay, I think I'm, I'm good, so... Please I'm like, good. comment, share us with all your friends, and subscribe. Rate, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Check us out in all of our other facets, which are linked below. And we will see you guys soon. See Love you next you. time. Squish you, grab this. I want to play video games. But I can't, because I have so much homework.